Hey, it's Nick. Hey, live from the backyard once again. And uh, the reason why I'm doing this one is, uh, and look at this, covered up and I got most of the stuff put away. It's a cloudy day. Actually, today is the day that we're going to have a solar eclipse and weather permitting. I'm going to go do a time lapse of it happening, but it might just rain, which is one of the big reasons why I'm doing this one. This is a vlog, and a good tip for you. Set up rain barrels. I got one, I've got, uh, you know, um, the gutters run down to uh, all four corners of the house here. And instead of letting that stuff just sneak away, uh, you know, I started to feel a couple of drops coming down, so I covered up the motorcycle and brought the Fresnel lens set up you know, into the garage and all that. But then I went and grabbed some containers. So there I'm going to collect a little bit of water. And uh, of course a tip, if, if you have a drainage system, you know, you do need to pay attention to that. Like these two go out to there through these. Those, there's one down there as well. Yet you can't really see it from here. But uh, there's one of those there as well, and it runs all the way out to the edge of my driveway. So I'm gonna have to pay attention to these two. And once they're full, either have to switch containers or um, you know hook it back up to that system. So, yeah. I don't have anything sprouting in the garden yet, but of course I didn't really expect it. But uh, hopefully after a good rain, we'll uh, have some stuff sprouting up. I started to uh, water this earlier and then I was like, why am I doing this? I don't need to do that. It's going to rain in a bit. That's why you can see some of it's kind of wet here. But uh, yeah, nothing sprouting yet. But. Uh, Hopefully it will, get some good rain. And uh, yeah, pay attention to my Facebook and YouTube and everything. And as long as it, uh, the weather allows me to, I'm going to go out uh, into the country where the view will be very good. And uh, I'll do a nice time lapse at uh, 1080, 1080p. Do it in nice, good, high resolution. I'll do a uh, uh, one 1080p image every one second, and I'll do that from about 720 because uh, it's supposed to start at 725, and uh, so I'll set that up, and um, I'll do uh, you know one image every one second uh, until I believe it's uh, 811 is sunset, so I'll keep doing it until then <clears throat> I'll try to capture as much of it as I can and uh, if it lasts too long I, I didn't I haven't done the math on what one second one image every second will end up being but uh, if it ends up being too long I'll speed it up a little bit in editing so that you guys don't have to sit there through like a 20 minute sun video or something uh, you already sit here listening to me blabber on for like 20 minutes so I'll try to make that one short, but it should look pretty cool as long as the clouds agree with me. So, without further ado, thanks for watching the video. Remember to collect your rainwater, and uh, uh, usually that water is uh, very, very safe for drinking. Uh, personally, I'm probably going to use all of it, uh, and it'd definitely be fine for bathing in, and uh, I'm definitely probably going to be using the majority of it for my garden. So, yeah, that's a a good little tip there and just pay attention to my videos and maybe I'll have some uh, solar eclipse stuff. So, in the words of my favorite YouTube musical artist, the ukulele, push the button.